Here is a traditional car, which looks like a car, drives like a car, parks like a car, was allowed a takeoff, a vertical takeoff. So first time something which is a traditional car and on top of that an electric car was allowed by U.S. government through FAA, a vertical takeoff for the limited purposes. But that means that um, flying cars in the traditional sense are now recognized, at least by one government. So think about the car on the ground. It goes up. And then your uh, passenger side becomes the bottom wing. And the driver's side becomes the top wing. And it turns like this. Now you're reutilizing the whole, every inch of your car as the wing. And I have a very efficient flight. There's going to be places where you're allowed to take off and the places where you're not going to be allowed to take off. Let's say like a whitelisted areas and a blacklisted areas, which will make sense. I think over time, those areas will shrink, um, expand or contract, right? But this is, I think, how it's going to, it's going to work.